Hello everyone, what's up? Dust Bunny Vigia here from Slackers of the Cover, bringing you a brand spanking new indie game hot off the release list. This is Semblance, brought to you by Good Shepherd Entertainment and Niamacope. Available both on Steam and Nintendo Switch's eShop. Links to those in the description below. Huge thank you to Niamco for giving us the opportunity to play this. I'm excited. And from listening to this beautifully crafted music for so long between adjusting and recording levels, trust me, there's a lot of adjusting for sound on this channel. I am super looking forward to seeing how this unfolds. Kudos for slam dunking the first impressions. Now, I've only explored about one world in just to get the grasp of controls and a little idea of my own of just what the game consists of. Of course, when I say one level, I mean it. But it was a struggle, let me tell you, it was fun. Simplest is an innovative little number with a twist on traditional puzzle platforming, encouraging you to transform the world around you in order to reach your goals and avoid hazards. Which sounds simple enough, right? But I can kind of see where it's going to get a little tricky later on, and I'm, I, I, I'm looking forward to that. So let's dive on in and see together what it's all about. Let's go. I did start a new game a couple times. It, it kind of awkward a little bit how that works, but it's probably just me. Little green guy jumping into the portal and... Into the world. Everything has gone crystal. That can't be good. Rise. My creature of doom that has no eyes. Where, where, where you go? So I just move. I am just a blob. Grab that, open up. Wait. Say what you will, but right below me, doesn't that look like a like a, like a chicken wing? Like a drumstick? I'm, I'm wondering if there's gonna be like a couple little images here and there that are kinda joking. I mean, there's a mushroom down there. Alright, we can't get through here. How? What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? You got eyeballs, I'm jealous. We got an eyeball. <laughs> we 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 are. What is it? Myoptic. Biopic. It's two eyes. Myopic is one. So we have the ability to sprint now. In pretty much any any direction we want, which is cool. You, you get some um, distance on that. And bam, we can brush right through this. Now this is cool. You can terraform the world around you with this new dash attack. Check that out. The little purple areas. I'm gonna smash the heck out of you, purple area. Oh, okay, maybe not here. Later. Get out of my way. I'm a slime when I got a places to go, people to see. Well, for the sake of first time running into, we can assume that the green stuff that's affecting the world is bad. All of our friendly little jiggly guys down there are dead, or frozen. So, one can say that's not good for us. So let's just spread across here. Break through. Break onto the other side. Like a new ability, we have two eyeballs now. Hey. And alt power. Doesn't really give you a name, but it seems to just reset the squishy world around you to what it's supposed to be. Of course, now we can't get through here, so smoosh it, set it, and forget it. We have two eyes. We are brethren. Hmm, so we've got a weird squiggly tree. A weird palm tree. It's like a sea enemy. Christmas tree. 
then a super crystallized square blocky tree right here. I'm assuming that these are the worlds that we're going to be encountering. So, four worlds, four parts. That's not bad. At least we know about how far the world's going to be and how expansive it is. Here we go, let's go. I, I dig all the uh, the layers of, of background and foreground and stuff. I mean, we get those little froggy people everywhere. Right. They're so cute. Kind of creepy. Oh, you, you guys actually like chuckle at me when I run by. <laughs> One down. Now we leave. We got what we came for. We're good. Decrystallization. It's a Tide Pod. We're cleaning the world. Let's go. Ooh. A more dark and sinister sounding. Oh, here it is. That's the first. That's the first slime tree we saw. Sup? Wanna roll? Yeah. Wait, this is squishy material, right? I got squish! Is there any, like, secret down here? I mean, would. I, I guess maybe it's just. Because the world is naturally squishy. We, we get that from the, the character and the world around us and stuff. So this, this crystalline infection from that green slime is ultimately killing everything around here. Oh, that's cool. I, I, can, I can be murderer of worlds, essentially. Ha 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 ha. I'm so sorry. You, you, you're, you're leaning weird because of me. Sorry, dude. Well, let's go in. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six shiny balls we gotta get from here. Oh, I don't know y'all here, bum. Sorry about that. Okay, exit point. Let's go adventure. Oh, we need our uh, alt here. Yeah. Hmm. What does this mean? So. Some sort of energy is releasing from each of these trees. Oh, okay. I think I get it. The other tree is super crystallized. These are probably supplements. So if we do these first three levels, and of course that would unlock the last level. Okay. Oh, I got this. Mario only wishes he could do that. Uh, can I fit the little bit of space there? Nope. Do I break it? That's that's not the break button. That's not the po force move. That's also not. Oh, <laughs> dumb bud. That's purple. I can squish it. Squish it down. Squish it. Give me it. More squish. Squish it all. Squish the world. Wait, how did, how did I stick here? That was weird. Okay. So get over there. I take it we can't just. We cannot. So if we're gonna have this issue to get over from one way, we're probably gonna have the issue from both sides. So let's just make them um, match a rule here. Jump on through to the other side. Restoration service, we gotta return it all back to normal. Otherwise, I just feel like a monster destroying their world. Whoa, whoa, 
whoa, whoa, whoa. Ha! Touch me with that hand, you will not. Though, now we have little flying creatures. So, the crystals seem to affect more than just us, then. It well, more than just our people. Excuse me? Okay, no, I need to be much further down. Let's, let's just take it, take it down as far as we can go. Oh, still not good. Come on, maybe, maybe, maybe I need to, on my way down? There we go. Jump a little, fall down, and then grab it on the way down. Where are you? Oh. I broke you, I'm sorry. Oh, but I can go through these on, on one side. Uh, I can't I can't go through on the top, so one way platforms. This is platforming 101. So I need to dash through it and not die. Can I? Ah! So I just need to weave. I cannot weave my way through that. It's gotta be some sort of with this, just, just making it go up, give me actually more room. I mean, technically, yes, no. Oh, heh. <laughs> Didn't mean that. Can't do it like that. Okay, let's I can go like this, I can go like that. I can break it here. Oh, you know what I probably need to do? I probably need to dash sideways. Oh okay, I get it now, I get it. I'm not supposed to, I'm not supposed to play with this. This is a lie. This is a red herring. What I'm supposed to do is like this and then I oh, I I'm gonna be bad. Let me be bad. I still nabbed it. Oh my. I'm on world one, I'm having issues. This isn't good. Ah! Okay. So, possibly not the solution I thought it was. Oh, it does slide that way. Okay. Yes, I got this. I don't like you. Alright, so we've discovered the aspect of sliding. I mean, I, credit to them for giving a puzzle that lets you I mean obviously you're not gonna dive straight down on the spikes at least most people don't drive dive drive straight down on the spikes so you're gonna want to try switching it from different angles it's that's good learning strategy I mean it, uh, learning through doing it's not like here's a tutorial it's like figure it out kid oh I'm still I'm still a little sticky on the controls. I could move it all. No, let's just. Aha! Speed clear. Who would love to see speed clears in this game? I'm using mouse and keyboard, by the way. I'm pretty sure you could do it with a controller. In fact, if you can do it with a controller, I would recommend it at this point. Because keyboard's a little bit iffy, but I, I think it may be my keyboard, particularly. All right. We got all of the little energy bits. Let's go. Oh yeah. Decrystallize that tree. That's the way I like it. Soft and squishy. Squishy tree.
Another tree! Easy tree. Another tree. Burn. Had to take a sip of the old iced tea. So you guys are like little squishy deer. Oh, you're adorable. You're probably going to be disgusting and try to eat me, aren't you? Alright, so... You've got spiky deadly parts. We've got the couple sections that we can totally break through now. Preemptively, we probably should set this up to where we can jump and break through that. Otherwise, it's gonna get bad. I was just thinking, I'm like, I can't get up there unless I jump up there, but then I can't dash twice, so what if we break it? What if we break it? What if we make ourselves a nice little platform to jump from? Oh, okay. Let's not make it as steep. Alright, let's... Oh, oh. There we go. Ha ha! I will succeed. What is down here? Oh, so. So, we, we, yeah, the little squishy people, there's plenty of squishy people. Oh my gosh, there's a squishy rabbit. I knew it. I knew there was going to be a squishy rabbit. I, I didn't know it. I'm not happy there's a squishy rabbit. So, squishy people, plenty of them, big family, and then one lonely crystal guy off in his crystal land. I get you. I keep hitting shift. I'm sorry. Shift just feels like the dash button to me. Whoa, so we just activated something. It's, I can't go in it. It's not a... Very squishy over here, but... Nothing I can directly interact with. Okay. Ow. Other than that, I can directly interact with that. I feel like I'm gonna have to reactivate that thing. Oh. Interacted. It's good. Not sure if. I mean, maybe that's a secret. Now. There is a thing right here. Like, it looks like a weird totem thing. A weird totem thing over here. Could be something similar to what I just activated. I don't know. Let's see. To keep an eye out for uh, special secret things. Anywhere with a story. Interesting. Okay. 
can do that. I'm sure you would need that one though. Actually, hold up, I do understand why you need this. Okay, maybe not. Can't make it go down now? Do I need to go down? Can I get it from here? I got it from here. Now let's go. Yeah, I'll worry about you in a sec. Let's head down here for now. We've got... <laughs> Jerry! Okay. I think I'm able to make this. We got this. Okay, maybe not as easy as I thought it would be. Oh, I get you now. Ha-ha! Follow me once, shame on you. Follow me twice. Something. Something. This looks like there's something shiny there, though. Alright, we've got to travel up there. Hmm. Now, what I want to do... is... Take this over here. Make a... There's no platform to that, that's cool. So you won't let me even make a platform there? Guess not. In the case, can I... I can platform here. Means maybe I can... Yeah. Can I adjust you? Not. However, I can like this. Hmm. Can I? Okay, I, I reset things at once. So. Concepts of this. It's not what I meant to do. Okay. Wow. Um. Maybe I had this backwards. Okay. So you let me move it like this. Will you let me? Can't move it. Okay, I think I think I figured it out. People over here are like, "You didn't figure it out, Jack." Yeah, I, I think I did. Okay, so moving the bottom one isn't the way you're supposed to do it because you lose the ability to adjust it. You can only adjust it, it seems, on one plane or the other for this one. So moving it left or right, you lose the ability to move it up or down. If I can get on top of that one, sure, I, might be able to do it. I might be able to do it. This one's sticking out. Can 
freeze myself. Okay, let's try it like this. Now, that's gonna be a little bit tricky. Ah! Is this the way they want us to take? Maybe. Maybe not. Does it matter, though? It's personally, a win is a win is a win is a win. The entire point of the game is to use the world around you to make your ascent to the things you have. Here we go. Problem solved. Onwards and outwards. Oh yeah. Our little dude is the coolest kid in school. Oh, we got the lasers. Lasers? I'm gonna assume a crystal laser kills you. Oh yeah, it does. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it kills you real fast. Which means we're gonna get some sort of way to block that laser. It's the only way to go down there. One, two, three, four, five, six. Let's go! There's only five. There's only five. I don't know why I counted six. Alright, our dear friends. We got lasers! Oh, oh, oh! Oh, that's clever. Okay, let's, let's not go crazy here. Oh, that's... That's awesome. It's gonna be tricky to get that son of a gun, but... Yeah! Down. Oh, that's that's cool. I'm about to go like here. Ha ha. Hmm. It just flat out block it. So when I bust through there, I don't stab myself in the face. We miss one. Oh. Well, we miss one. There we go. Ooh. Oh, they block each other. Okay, that's really cool. Yeah, it's easier than making that crazy jump. There we go. Now we're all caught up. Hmm. Here's what I think I'm gonna do. I don't think there's enough room to turn it into itself to the right. So what if we go here and then lock it like that and then fall into it like that. That works, right? Oh, I am a little bit curious up here. What's up here? Seem like nothing. They don't seem like nothing up there. Trying to trick me. All right, maybe. One more crystallized tree busted. However, now that we learned the secret, 
Now we know the secret. There was, there was nothing blocking this laser the entire time. This is brilliant. See, anyone walking into the situation probably looked and not even realized that you could move the laser. Because you're like, okay, yeah, I can move stuff around it. My brain didn't click in for that. Move it down, laser block, let's go. Another world. I, I, I'm gonna just explore real quick. What's over here? Besides, there's a laser. I'm stuck. Oh, I'm not stuck, actually. I, I, I think I just adhere to what is considered ground surface. In this case, it's technically ground surface. Ground surface. The ground surface. Another tree over here. Oh man, I actually I explore. So it looks like we got three more trees left in this main first world here. Those three we we did what three just now? Those will have to remain until next episode, folks. I am really enjoying this. This is fun. Uh, it's it's different. It's interesting. There's a little bit of thinking involved. I mean, that one puzzle, I was, like, usually I'm really good at puzzles. That took me a second. I, I'm still not convinced we solved it in the way, in the manner that they originally wanted us to solve it in. But, you know, the, the way this is, uh, it's very open-ended. You solve it however you figure out you can solve it by using the game's mechanics. And I, I like puzzle platformers. I like puzzles in that in general, that... Use your mind, figure out your own solution, and go for it. So thank you everyone for joining me. Thanks for watching. For more news and information on what's going on or what may be, check out the description below. If you like what you saw and want to see more like it, blam that subscribe button and share the video. Make sure to check out Symbolance, Niamacope, and Good Shepherd Entertainment's game. Links will all be in the description below. I believe the price point on it is $8.99 on Steam. I do not know what it is on eShop. I assume it's about the same. I don't have a Switch. But, you know, I know some of you do, and uh, this would be really fun on a Switch, too. It's it's, it's low-key, it's beautiful, it has pretty de pretty good controls. We're good to go on that. I'll see you guys in the next video. Later on the ground! I exploded when I alt-tapped. <laughs> Uh, why can't I explode more often when I alt-tap? Bye, folks. See you!